or in unit three from uh, the book. Uh, this unit is okay. It all went wrong. So if you look to the title here, it all went wrong. So it's obviously that this uh, unit is just like focus on the past tense. And I'm sure like every one of you know what is the past tense. The past tense that, as I mentioned, okay, that it is used when we talk about the event or action that happened in the past. So it's no more happen okay in recent uh like uh time or even in the future okay so let's look to the starter here in the starter here you're gonna find like they give you already the past tense for irregular verbs what is irregular verbs and because one of the issue that maybe some of you have uh, made actually mistake it is like how to know okay uh, the irregular verbs of the past or even the past participle so here they just give you a very uh, basic uh, verbs like here where where is already from like the verb it is are which is like already it is be okay so a c which is already the base verb it is c went of course is go told tell okay said say had have okay took take and gave give got get okay and here could could it is already the best tense for can okay well made is what make and did of course come from the verb do or does okay so this is basically it's just like a starter it's just show you um uh, what is like uh, the past tense for irregular verbs okay so here uh if we look like to grammar spot here okay they also here is talk about uh the past tense okay and they ask you about the past tense of these verbs the most important thing that you have to focus on it's like how to add it, um, the suffix, the ed for the verb in the past tense. And also the most important issue that how to pronounce. Okay. This is also another issue. Like ask when I added ed is not something is like, uh, like ask it. No, ask okay ask because some of the verb is pronounced like t while some verb is pronounced like only d when when some of the verbs add like uh, pronounce it okay so basically uh, not have the only the same pronunciation لا. يكون بعضها من نضيف لها d uh, يكون ed is sort of pronounced like d okay well some of them is just like pronounced like t okay or while the other group is just like it okay like when we added ed is look it okay for hanana is the same thing is just like give you examples here but the most important like how to pronounce it this is really important for speaking and also maybe it is not like for example the test maybe i i, I bring like some of these uh, kind of questions like okay how, how you pronounce this like in, in the word okay uh this word okay so here ask asked okay show showed here only d right okay want wanted so here is not ed no is id so wanted okay here walk walked is look like t right okay start started okay so id okay and uh, to uh here uh like uh, like liked okay well believe believe uh, here is believe here basically it's what okay so here believed okay and use used okay well stop here stop stop it okay stop it okay and uh plant plant okay and this is they give you here because you have to um double um 
the consonant sound and then you added ed طبعا هاي already احنا ماخذيها بال بالسنوات الدراسيه السابقه when you have a consonant sound شنو consonant sound اللي حرف صحيح plus اللي هو شو يكون يكون حرف عله اللي هي احنا الخمسه اللي نعرفها and then we already have like the consonant sound فلازم we have to double it this is even like you should already know يعني هذه احنا شيء obviously no I'm just trying to review it for you just to refresh your memory okay well here some of these verb when you it's already end with e so this way I don't need like to uh, added ed because that impossible so it's just like added d so like like okay I just added d believe believed and use use Okay, so here just like focus on how to write it correctly with the right pronunciation. Okay, and if we look here in a grammar spot, okay, also is like here is talk about the past tense, but when we use the past tense, okay, to give more details or even to connect between two uh, two sentences. يعني احنا عادة ال ال verb okay نحكي نستخدم ال past tense when we talk about the action or event that happened in the past شيء صار بالماضي وانتهى but it is impossible that you write or speak is just like a short sentences يعني أنت مستحيل بين أنت تحكي على ال 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 تستخدم ال tense okay a tense so past tense أو present tense بس هنا نحن دا يركزنا على past tense مستحيل أن تحكي جمل قصيرة that make you like okay speak so weird okay لأن إحنا عادة من نحكي ما نقول مثلا على سبيل المثال I open the door period okay I found my parents period so this is look weird even when you speak okay you maybe you feel like really foreign Okay, and even foreign when they try to speak, maybe connected. So this is one of the most important things. That is why we need connectors. Shino no connectors li adat rabat hinane. So in the past tense, we use two connectors most of the time. Okay, and these connectors here, I'm gonna uh, like try to uh, explain to you here on the word. Okay, so here we have the first one when. All of you use when, right? I see like in your paper that you use when but the right um, uh, tense that you have to use when you have to be very careful because when it just give you okay is a kind of like okay um, the event sequences يعني تسلسل الأحداث Okay, شلون تكون؟ مثلا على سبيل المثال when I arrived home when I arrived home okay هذا حدث كوما ليش اخلي كوما because already جملة بش start start with when فانا عندي الجملة اذا بدت بconnectors فلازم شي اخلي اخلي كوما حتى اربطها بالجملة الثانية ما اخلي period او ما احاول بس اربطها بدون كوما uh, that really mistake okay so when I arrived home okay the door was Open. Okay, so here when um, I arrived home, okay, the door was opened. Okay, opened. So that re that mean that the events they are just like in sequences. تسلسل الأحداث كان بترتيب. فإذا كان هذا in the past tense فهذا شو يصير? In the past tense. Okay, على سبيل المثال عفوك the door was open مثلا نقول when I arrived home I found okay I found like for example uh, I found my cousin okay I found my cousin over there so I found my cousin over There, how that? خلي نحكيها مات ال the active voice اللي هو مبني المعلوم. Okay, over there. هو كان ابن عمي موجود بال بالبيت. Okay, فهذا معناها الحدثين كانوا متقارب. أنا فتحت الباب. أنا وصلت للبيت. لقيت ابن عمي موجود. Okay, فتسلسل بالأحداث. هذه أحداث. So when we have two events, 
you have to make it like in sequence that is why you use the when here like to connect between two events in the same time in the same tense sorry بنفس الزمن يعني ما يصير هنا انا استخدم مضارع وهنا انا استخدم ماضي that impossible ما يصير اني من ابدي connect between two sentences استخدم واحد بالماضي واحد بالمضارع that really impossible to happen so you can use for example you can use this or the present continuous has راح نحكي عليها the past continuous او تستخدمه ويا the present perfect وهذا شيء اخر بعدين نحكي عنه اوكي سو من عندك تسلسل بالاحداث فلازم هاي تكون شطر الجمله الاولى يكون بالماضي والشطر الجمله الثانيه يكون ايضا as well like uh, in the past the same thing if i try like to say okay i found my cousin when i arrived home that's right and in this case i don't need like comma here Okay, why I don't need like comma? Because I already put the when as a connectors. So when we have connector at the beginning of the sentence, so you need like comma. Otherwise, you don't need like comma when you put it in the middle. Okay, for this case, the first one. I can use the when when I talk in the present tense. Okay, for example, but in this case, you can use it with the future. For example, when I will graduate, uh, sorry, when I, um, when I graduate, when I graduate, when I graduate, I will work. Here I see it. I see it present, a future. Okay, I see it present, a future. I will see it in past, past continuous. But it's possible to see it in past with the present. It's possible to connect the sentence with past with the present. Okay? And the other connectors that also we use it with the past tense, especially. Okay? When we have like two action, I say two action. Okay? When I have, let's say, actually. Okay? And one, it is like a long action. What is a long action or long event? A event that is long. Okay, is interrupted with short action or short event. فهنا أنا ال ال time مالته الوقتين يكون مختلف. واحد حدث كلش طويل والآخر يكون كلش قصير. The same when I say while I was okay studying for finally or for final. Okay. Or finals here. Finals are امتحانات النهائية. So it is understood from the context that I'm talking about final test. So I don't need like to use test. Okay. Um. So while I was studying, while I was studying, this is the past continuous, past progressive. Okay. So. عادة الدراسة مش نستغرق ساعتين ثلاثة أربعة whatever. Okay. لهذا السبب راح هنا يتقاطع بحدث صغير اللي هو شو نقول. The rank. Oh, sorry. The phone. Rank. The telephone. Tick. Or, for example, on the street. For example, my mom called me. Where was the last one? اتصال والدتك او خلينا نقول والدتك صاحتك او القرايه فالحدث الطويل هو اللي I was studying يعني خلال هذا الوقت the studying الحدث الطويل شنو هو interrupt شنو interrupt معناه يعني خلينا نقول uh, interrupt عارض او حدوث اثناء حدوث الحدث الثاني اقدر انا شو استخدم مثلا وين My mom called me. Okay, good friend. Your mom is already like the home. Okay, so my friend. Okay, when my friend called me, I was studying. Okay, I was studying. يعني بما معناه الوايل دائما تأخذ present sorry past 
continuous or بس progressive okay فالحدث الثاني هو يكون بالسمبل بس أو إذا كانت أني الوين دائما تكون متأخذ I N G في حالات متأخذ بس continuous هاي بحالات عموما ما نحكي عنها this level بس anyway هي هاي الحالة العموما إحنا نستخدمها دائما الحدث الطويل I was studying for finals أوكي هو الحدث الطويل القطع القطع بيش when my friends called me Okay, so this is basically the most important grammar that maybe you, some of you, okay, have a problem with. Okay, so now let's come back to to the book and let's see what they are talking about. As they said here, the same thing. Okay, when we arrived, she made some coffee. Okay, so th that means th that mean the two action is just like two events happen at the same time. But if I say here, when we arrived, she was making sub coffee. يعني إحنا إحنا وصلنا بس هي كانت بدها تحضر بالمطبخ. إحنا وصلنا لربما وإيش وقت وصلنا بدقيقة بعشر دقائق. بس هي لربما كانت بدها تسوي procedure مالت ال ال الكوفي ميكر. فهذه هنا شنو يعتبر أكشن طويل. فخلت لا إي إن جي. بس مستحيل أن أخلي بجملة الوين أخلي لها إي إن جي. أوكي. So this is really important that you have to focus on. And if you look here, discussing grammar, I want you like to uh, do like a practice number two, okay? And also practice number one. This is talk about the same thing that I talk about it, okay? Yeah. So this is the most important. Here, let's just talk about like um, some of the we say some of the like uh, words that we use it at the beginning of the sentence like fortunately and fortunately what well, what's mean fortunately fortunately يعني لحسن الحظ unfortunately this will help when we already try to give a bad news we start with unfortunately احنا عادة بالكتابة او بالكلام من اني ارد اعطي bad news او مثلا على سبيل المثال اعطي بان النتيجة تكون okay negative فانا دائما استخدم unfortunately بس من اني دي احكي مثلا على الشيء دا اعطي بوزيتيف ريزالت او اعطي جود نيوز او اعطي في الشيء يعني اوكي دا اقول هذا الموضوع نجح فش استخدم استخدم فورشلي اند هوبفولي اوكي سو ذيس از وي يوز ات لايك تو جيف لايك ام جست لايك تو جيف مور سترينث تو يور سنتنسز اوكي تعطي بعض من القوه لل بالمعنى للجمل اللي انتم تقولوها او it's kitwoh okay yeah so th this is the most important that you have to look for it and here guys no nouns verbs adjectives for vocabulary section here like you know guys you already know that about the suffix so what should suffix 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 إذا أكو مقطع نضيفة بداية الجملة نسمي prefix أوكي مثل fortunately unfortunately unfortunately هنا هنا unfortunately uh, that mean it is a prefix أوكي لكن ال suffix هو المقطع اللي نضيفة نهاية الجملة فإحنا بعض من المقاطع اللي نضيفها some of these uh, suffixes we know that this is a noun or adjectives شلون for nouns most of the time we added Asian like okay or sh like uh, here ions we, we are always pronounced like shin okay ness all the time ness all the time it is like um, I just consider as a noun like happy happiness mad madness okay here it okay while here ends here is shin and also is meant Okay, هذه المقاطع دائما بتكون بالnouns. Okay, نضيفها to give us like uh, the noun form uh, for the verb. Well, here for adjectives we added us. Okay, serious. Okay, here um, gorgeous. Okay, we added the yeah like funny. Okay, funny. Okay, here we had like here typic like. For example, uh, you can say um, wherever, like about like terrific. We I just added like fantastic, okay. Uh, or for example, terrific, okay. So here, ly, we just added like health, healthy, 
okay or just added like um, added ly like a friend a friendly okay well here's full full is all the time because in latino uh it's just like give us like full which is like give us um يعني, like for example uh if we say uh faithful okay يعني مخلص جدا. okay uh for example if we say like um useful so yeah this is like also as adjectives well less okay helpless homeless okay so this is we use it okay and i'll like a practical okay so guys here i want you like to focus on this and read it please try to read it okay because this is really important like communication okay this is the noun i know not the noun or I know how to use it from the shin. Communicate while here. Okay, discussion. Discuss. Okay. Govern. Here is government. Government. Okay. Invitation. Invite. Okay. Develop here. Development. We can say it. Okay. Explain as a verb. So explanation. Okay. Education. Educate. Okay. Decision. Decide enjoy enjoyment okay so i want you like guys like to do this okay and don't forget that this is really important okay and since it is important so we're gonna have it like in the test okay so just focus on this and this is the same thing that use the uh word form by using here okay please try to practice it because this is really important not only for the test but to develop your vocabulary okay so this is the most thing that I want you to focus on for the reading basically it's just not um, one of the articles that maybe we find it is, is really important okay but it's just to talk about authentic language and should authentic language it's just like uh, the language it is used okay so feel free like to read this because this is the language of the news okay but the most important that you have to focus on a grammar spot of vocabulary okay thank you so much